and this time the leg's actually going to go behind us. So when it goes behind you, the leg that you're on stays bent, the leg that you're off of, uh, that should also stay bent and it goes behind you, uh, so directly behind you. All right, on that same one, the main focus is to distribute your weight across down your leg, all your weight goes down your leg, into your foot, into the heel specifically on the, on the, uh, in the boot. I always tell the kids, lift up your toes inside your boot and really press into the heel. So when you press into the heel, um, again, you get a good strong grip. Um, so inside your skate, uh, your heel presses right into the ice, your toe is barely touching the ice, and you're distributing all that weight through into the ice, giving you those roots that you need, giving you that grip that you need as well. Last one was a quick uh, one-legged, single-legged, inside edge heel pushes. Uh, the next one we're doing is a large. So uh, with the quick ones, we held them for maybe one second. You're on your foot for one second. This one, try to hold them for at least two seconds, if not three seconds. And uh, there should be a larger hip rotation as well. So here's what it looks like. On that one, uh, we have two different types of cuts in the ice that we're going to be making. The first cut is you're holding your C-cut, and that's called the grind. So when you're grinding, you're placing all your weight into the heel, and you're holding the inside edge. At the very end of the C-cut, you want to now distribute your weight, not from your heel, but now into the toe. So the first one's a grind, the second one's the rip. If you don't do the rip, then you don't push onto the next stride. So when you do it, you'll more or less just be stepping from left to right. So when I do it, you'll hear the grind at the beginning, and then the rip. Grind first, then the rip. And when you're ripping, just like you're taking a regular stride, you push off on the toe, distribute your weight to your other leg, and then push. The louder it is, the better it is. All right, last one of the Inside Edge Going Forward series of drills is uh, the same thing we just did, only now you should be sitting down so low that uh, while you're on your right leg, you're gonna be able to easily touch the ice with your left hand. And while you're on your left leg, you should easily be able to touch to the inside of your body onto your right. Main thing is you should be able to easily hear uh, the distinction between the grind and then the rip. The grind and then the rip. Next 